Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Floss back again with another video and today we're going to take a look at the Huawei FreeBuds 2 Pro. Now you can pick these up from a bunch of different websites. The cheapest I found them was on a website called giztop.com. Now I'll throw the link up in the description. The price on these, 140 bucks. Now they come in three different colors. You got black, white, and blue. Now shout out to everybody that watches my videos. I promised y'all when I did the free buds, if I like these, I was gonna check out the free buds too. Not only do I like these, I fell in love with them. So I got high hopes for the free buds 2 pros. All right, so let's go through the specs real quick. First things first, shout out to White Shoes, back in the building. White shoes, white shoes, calm down. All right, you got a 420 milliamp battery that's gonna give you two and a half hours worth of music time. Now with the charging case, that's gonna add another 15 hours. You got Bluetooth 5.0, you got your AI voice assistant, so this is gonna work with your Siri and Google Now. Now these feature bone and sound pattern recognition. So what that means is, while you're wearing the headphones, you can use them to unlock your phone. Pretty sick. Now they are IP54 dust and water resistant. You can't submerge them, but if they get wet due to rain or sweat, you're good to go. Now one of the dopest features about these headphones, wireless charge. All right, wireless charge on deck, and if you got a Mate 20 Pro, you can use your phone to wirelessly charge the headphones. Sick. All right, so let's unbox these and see what it is. Now these are, aren't available in the USA, so these are the Chinese version. If you look at the back, what does all that say? I don't know. All right, let me grab a little unboxing knife. What we got? Spider-Man on deck. Here we go. Ra. Now this time, I'm gonna do these correctly. Shout out to the YouTube correction officers. I know, last time I forgot to show y'all the USB charging cable. I'm holding the L on that. We're gonna do this right though. All right, Huawei FreeBuds 2 Pro. Nice looking presentation. Okay, this slides right out. Here's your earbuds. Now, I'm not going to take these out yet because white shoe's ready to pounce. Let's see. Here's the charging case. Now, of course, of course, of course, we're going to have to compare these to the Apple AirPods. Those are the industry standards. I already know what y'all getting ready to say. Oh, they copied off Apple. They copied off Apple. I know. I know. We'll talk about that in a minute. Here's your charging case. Huawei branding on the front. Okay, a little LED light. There's your Bluetooth pairing button. USB type C charge on the bottom. Let's see what else you get. Okay. <laughs> I know. Now you got your micro USB charging cable. All right. The FreeBuds 2 Pro. Ah, uh, the FreeBuds 2. They had the, uh, the FreeBuds. The FreeBuds had the charging cable too. I missed that. And on a side note, whenever y'all watch my videos, before you leave a comment on your YouTube correction officer shit, make sure you read the video description. Any mistake I make is going to be in the description. That's your charging cable. Let's see what else you get. Usual books and shit. Pluck them and file them. And that's pretty much it. Now, I'm going to make sure that there's nothing else in here. We're going to do this correctly. Rah. All right, nothing else in there. Now, for the earbuds. Let's pop these out. Now, one thing I will say, shoes, scoot, scoot. A little bit on the thick side. Giggity. Let's see. Uh, <laughs> white shoes, I need you to fall back. Got the little red trim on the top. I like that. Let's see now. Let me tell you this. One of the things that I fell in love with the free buds is this. Let me show you. Let me pull out the free buds real quick. You see on the free buds, and we're gonna talk about this in a minute. You see you got those, the ear tips, they stay in your ear. Now these ones right here, the free buds pro two, they're more like the Apple AirPods, no rubber tips. So I'm pretty sure these ain't gonna be the best for working out, but we'll see what it is. Let's drop these in the charging case to see what it looks like. Let's see. <laughs> Shoes, calm down. <laughs> oh, it's been a while, man, it's been a while. All right, once you put them in the case, let's see. You see your LED lights turned on. They're charging up. Now, let's check that wireless charge feature. Let me grab a Mate 20 Pro. Matter of fact, I'll, try, I'll let me try a regular wireless charge and then we'll try the phone. Alright, so first let's try wireless charging using a regular wireless charger. Just like that. Now you see those blue lights lit up? It's wirelessly charging. That is pretty sick. Alright, let's do that one more time. 
wireless charger on deck. Now let's try it from the Mate 20 Pro. All right, so if you got a Mate 20 Pro, go over to settings, you see reverse wireless charging, turn that on, power off the display. You see the headphones, no flashing lights. Drop it down, flashing lights. Wirelessly charge your headphones from the phone. That is so sick. Now I know what y'all getting ready to say. Oh, they copied the AirPods. I know, I know. But me, I'm a consumer. If I got 150 bucks to spend on some headphones, I want the ones that have the most features. And right now, it's the FreeBuds Pro 2. All right, so let's pair these up and do a little sound test. All right, so here's a quick comparison versus the FreeBuds and the AirPods. Okay, here's your AirPods. Here's your FreeBuds 2. As you can see, the FreeBuds 2, they're a little bit thicker. Basically about the same size. Here's the FreeBuds and the AirPods. These are pretty thin. And here's the FreeBuds and the FreeBuds 2. Let me try to move my fingers out the way. You see the difference in the thickness? A little bit thicker. Let me show you what it's going to look like when you're wearing them. All right, so here's the FreeBuds Pro 2. That's what it's going to look like in your ears. Now, one thing I got to say, all of these to me, they look fucking silly, but the black color looks a little bit better. All right, if you're going to get them, get them in black. That's what they look like when you're wearing them. All right, so now let me do a little sound test and I'll compare the three. All right, so I'm rocking the FreeBuds Pro 2 right now. I'm comparing them to the AirPods and the FreeBuds. I'm listening to a whole bunch of different songs and I got to keep it real with y'all. The AirPods and the FreeBuds Pro 2, they sound exactly the same. All right, if you're buying these for music, they sound identical. Now, here's my two cents. If you want a good pair of headphones to listen to music, don't buy any of these. All right, if you want music, get the Bose, get the Sonys, get the Jabras. These sound a thousand times better than all of these. Now, if you're buying these to talk on the phone, that's another story. But sound quality wise, the AirPods and the FreeBuds Pro 2, they sound identical. If I had to pick from the three, believe it or not, give me the FreeBuds. And part of the reason is, you see that little seal? That little seal that goes around your ear, that makes it sound a lot better. Now, they might all sound exactly the same, but with those little rubber tips, you get a nice seal in your ear. It makes the music sound louder. Without the seals, these just don't sound that loud. Now, I'm back here doing a little bullshit fake workout. I could definitely not wear these to the gym, even though they are IP54. Once you start sweating, just like the AirPods, they're going to start slipping and sliding in your ears. Let's check the double tap function. All right, so let me put them back in. I'm going to double tap. Keep your eye on the play and pause. All right, so now the music is playing again. Double tap again. Pause. Let's try the Siri. What's the weather for tomorrow? All right, so the double tap functions do work. Again, if you're buying these for talking on the phone, they the best. IDs and the AirPods, they the best. Matter of fact, let me do a little test phone call just to solidify this. All right, so let's call the 24-hour diner and see what time they close. FreeBuds Pro 2. Let's get max volume. Yes, hi. What time you guys close today? Oh, 24 hours. Okay, great. All right, thank you. All right, phone calls, super loud, crystal clear, and yes, you hear sound out of both ears. All right, so again, if you're buying these kind of headsets for talking on the phone, these, the AirPods, the FreeBuds, they all sound incredible. But for music, this is just my honest opinion, for music, I would pass on all of these and get something real like the Bose, the Sonys, the Jabras, the JBLs, anything, basically anything other than these ones. Now, I got a little story I'm going to tell you at the end of the video. Overall, though, on a scale of 1 to 10, these are definitely a major go. And let me tell you why I fell in love with these real quick. 
wearing these. I th this is the one. This is the one thing now. Like I said, if you're planning on buying these, maybe you work at an office somewhere and you're gonna wear these all day long. All right? You're not gonna take them off for eight hours straight. You can't wear these. All right? The bows. Look, look at look at the size of the bows. <laughs> look, look at this. You cannot wear these. Look how big these are. The wings. The comfort factor, you cannot wear these, the Sonys, the Jobbers. You can't wear none of these all day long. If you plan on wearing these all day long, then get something like these. And this is kind of the reason why I fell in love with these. I'd have had them on for eight hours straight. After a while, you're going to forget that you're wearing them. All right, they fit in here nice and lightweight. And having the, the rubber seal on this is a good thing and a bad thing. The reason it's good, if you're listening to music or you're trying to work out, they're going to stay in your ears better. All right, it's kind of like noise cancellation. When you put these on with no music, nothing playing, stick both of these in your ears, it's going to get real quiet. That's because of the seal. Now, that's a good thing and a bad thing. If you're sitting in your office somewhere and you're just wearing these all day, you don't want them to be too sealed in your ear. You still want to hear your ambient sounds. That's why I've been rocking the AirPods. I to rock the AirPods. If I'm using, if I'm sitting at my desk all day, I might have one AirPod in. This way, I could take a phone call. People could still talk to me. I can hear all my surroundings. Same thing with these. You can wear these all day long without that rubber seal. All right, white shoes. <laughs> Calm down. You can wear these all day long without them falling out your ears, and you still hear your surroundings. All right, let's let's pop these back in the case, so the shoes don't kill me. All right, let's see how these go back in. All right. Got to get the hang of these. All right, just like that. Again, <laughs> if I had to choose, all right, if I had to choose, I wish the AirPods came in black. If the AirPods came in black, I guarantee you a lot of people, a lot of people would like these a little bit more because the white version, they do look extra douchey. All right, now, some people want to look like a douche. That's your choice. But I noticed when I was rocking the black ones, they look a little bit more discreet, a little more stealthy. Still look fucking silly, but a little bit less. All right, a little bit less. Let's drop these in the case, too. Again, let me wrap this up. All right, let me use white shoes proof these headphones. If I had to choose, all right, for talking on the phone, it's going to be one of these two. I'm going with the Warways just because of the black color, not to mention the wireless charge. Don't have to walk around with no cables. Look-wise... They both look silly. These look kind of thick, too. I mean, I don't like the look of none of them, <laughs> honestly, but it's just the color. If the AirPods came in black, it'd be another story. Music-wise, the original Free Buds, like I said, because of the seal. Anyway, Huawei Free Buds 2 Pro. Hit me up in the comments. Let me know what y'all think about these. And stand by for a quick story. I got the proof. Check this out. I got the proof. Shout out to everybody rocking with me on Facebook, Foursquare, Twitter, Google Plus. Shout out to all the Google Gangsters. I see y'all holding down that Facebook page. Shout out to everybody hitting me up on Boxer. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with me on Instagram. Y'all know that's where I'm at full time, 100% full throttle. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with the new stream on Sundays. Y'all already know, stream gangsters on deck. Get your drinks ready. No meat boys allowed. Yeah. Special shout out to everybody following me on Snapchat Flossy underscore Carter That's where I'm at And a special shout out to the notification squad I'll see y'all in the comment section early Hashtag salute Oh yeah, one more thing I almost forgot Fellas, ladies Say it with me All y'all haters All y'all trolls Close your eyes and picture me rolling. It's your boy Floss, I'm out. Deuces. Spock won the beam up. Energize. Alright, so before I get out of here, let me tell y'all a little story. Now, shout out to my brother Mook. If y'all follow us on Instagram, you already know. Mook is the number one Apple fanboy of America and the number one Android hater. 
Anything that's Apple, automatically top of the line, best in the world. Anything that's Android, Samsung, or non-Apple is automatically trash. Whatever. So we're sitting around on New Year's. We're having our little card game. We get into the subject of AirPods. Now, Mook being the number one Apple fanboy, right out of the back, he said the AirPods are the best earbuds in the world. Now, I said, look, for talking on the phone, yeah, I can agree with you. I like them for talking on the phone. But when it comes to music, the AirPods are trash. And basically, everything sounds better. That kind of blew his mind. He was a little bit tight. I said, look, I got a challenge for you. I'm going to give you some Samsung Icon X free of charge. All you got to do is use them for a week and give me your honest opinion. Let me show you the message that came right after that. A week later, you see at the top, that's Mook. Look at the message. Yo, these Icon X sound a hundred times better than the AirPods and are way more comfortable in my ears. I'm ready to throw them AirPods out the window. Look at my response. LOL, I told you. Basically everything, capital letters, everything sounds better than AirPods. Now, of course, Mook being an Apple lover, got to jump back on the bandwagon. Apple got me. If they just copy this format, they, be, they can run the game. Might not use my AirPods again. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. The moral of the story is this. When it comes to music, AirPods, and even both of these Huawei's, they sound like trash compared to real earbuds. Again, if you're buying these for talking on the phone, knock yourself out. But for music, get some real ones.